Certainly, Governor Maggie Hassan, uh, less than a month on the job, is looking for an issue on which she can galvanize support in the legislature, bipartisan support. She's going to get it this coming week with the bill that would double the research and development tax credit um, in the state. This is a tax credit that business owners are eligible to have against their business profits tax for investments in research and development. It has a hearing before the state senate, ways and means committee uh, this coming week, and there's no doubt in my mind this bill is going to fly through very quickly. Could even be a unanimous vote in the state senate. Both Senate President Peter Bragdon and the Senate Democrats have indicated it's both a priority for them. And let's not give them too much credit here. This is no big tax cut for business in New Hampshire. All it really does is doubles the amount that business can apply for the credit from $1 million a year to $2 million a year. It doesn't increase the credit that they receive. It doesn't make anyone eligible for the credit that they weren't already eligible for. What's happened is that businesses have been oversubscribing this tax credit uh, for a number of years. More businesses have applied for it than have been able to receive it. They've actually had to prorate how much uh, businesses actually get on the tax break each year for a couple of years now. So this will allow that uh, to occur. This uh, will be an early victory for uh, the legislature of both parties and a nice early win uh, for Governor Maggie Asson.